going to read um, a poem from Strike Anywhere, which was published in uh, 1995. And it's just, it's a wonderful, wonderful book. It's, um, it, it's got a variety of forms and it's, you know, it's got all of his signature uh, elements. And um, he, you know, what Oscar says is true. It, we, we feel uh, elated and lifted up in some way by Dean's poetry, but also there's a complex sense of the layers of existence and the tragic also. Um, and this, uh, this book was dedicated to um, Dean's um, first wife, Cornelia Nixon, who would have liked to be here but couldn't, couldn't make it. Um, this is called Centrifuge. It might have been midnight when last we talked, and now I've got this poem that keeps flying apart, which accounts under these xenophobic stars for all force, gravity, magnetism, wind, the lingering of a kiss, a judo throw, although there's yet to be a single formula for it. Save us from single formulas. One room smells like ash, another smells like fruitcake. One cardinal sits on a branch, another under. You've got to be a bird to understand any of this, feathery and hollow boned. You've got to be a claims adjuster staring at a storm. You've got to be entered by a shower of gold coins. On the back of the Brazilian book of poems, the translator looks haggard as if she's chased a mule cart into another century, the 20th and suddenly she's feeble in Pittsburgh in her bunny furs. Imagine suddenly Pittsburgh, the handful of dust thrown up for the sun's haughty inspection, laughing its molecular laugh, hungry again, dazzling again in its stained satin pajamas like the memory of lost love. I think we were walking through some woods towards more to drink, up ahead, the future gesticulating wildly, like a beggar who'd scared us out of money. The future threatening to isolate us, like glum geniuses prowling record stores, not getting a lot done, mistaken for clerks with gum on our shoes. I'm trying not to panic. I'm trying to find the center, drive a nail through it like a mercy killing. I'm letting myself be thrown around while, come at me, says the day to the night. Come at me, says the cloud to the moon, dragging its terrible noose. Come at me, says Elle, so she can show me what she's learned in martial arts. And now some part of me can't or won't get up. The ground husky with thaw, falls idiot nomenclature garbled in the bramble. I'm letting my back get soaked. I'm turning into wine. I'm a broken core, lips barely parted, saying, what? I know suffering does not make us beautiful. It makes us disappear, like wearing black shirts at midnight, like lying on the spinning earth, crying, mama, mama. <clears throat> this is a poem, a new poem that I just finished, dedicated to all of you all. <clears throat> After a very long, difficult day, you talk to your loved ones at night. It is a kind of modernism. Color sees into you, thinks a warm path, a tint of meaning brought from how you feel. Then you are double. The owl calls out, Taito Alba, in your sleep. Scrape, scrape, heart-shaped heart face emitting loose nouns. Under its turf, the smart mouse turns, the fierce dead merge with the recently born, where earlier they emptied what you seek. How will you be known? Some registered complaints. You pass them in the hallway, their new haircuts. The bosses are known by new wars. What salmon are left hurry upstream, cold swaths in the bay. Linnets by rose fire at the edges Linnet or finch, the word edge has wings made of E. The moon rests in a mantle of minutes, it 
its boundaries in back of the trees. Boundaries are known by their nothings. You will be known by your dreams.